The Rockets CEO, Tad Brown, just came on a podium and announced that owner Leslie Alexander has put the team up for sale. This is going to be interesting now with this new collective bargaining agreement. These teams are so profitable in the NBA and the value of them. Houston's a big market team. They've got James Harden now locked in for six years. Mm -hmm. And Leslie has been one of the, I, I think, one of the real significant owners in the league. But he's into his 80s now. And, you know, you're going to start to see some of those owners in advancing years cash in on these teams. And, and now that starts with Houston. And we've seen the value just escalate so much in the last few years. Milwaukee, the Clippers, of course, uh, Sixers even. Warriors. And, and right? think about the value, the Clippers, going for $2 billion because Chris mm -hmm. Paul came into L.A. He increased the value of that team. And Chris Paul will have, you know, he will not hurt the value of that Houston team, which is already a team in a market with a great fan base. And what makes Houston unique, too, is their appeal in the Far East. Because of Yao Ming, yep. they are the team in China, and that adds to their value and their worth. Huge revenue overseas for their merchandise and everything else. And apparently, all you need is Chris Paul to come to your team, right. and you can just double or triple your value. Who do you see as potential buyers? Who's been trying to get in on an NBA team who might flock to this opportunity? Well, there, there are so many potential buyers is again it's it is hard to lose money now on an NBA team they are worth uh, with the television deal the built-in revenue um, is just remarkable in the league and I think that will be a number uh, over you know it's early but over a billion uh, a billion and a half these teams have tremendous value and uh, I, I think Leslie Alexander will, will have a tremendous bidding process there to get it done. And Adam Silver plays a big part in vetting who they'd like. You know, th th there are so many groups who have been trying to get involved with teams that are making offers to teams and owners all over the league whose teams aren't for sale. Right. So, well, we'll have to see where this goes. It's going to be interesting. As we've seen, just one owner ownership going coming in can change the chemistry around the league. So it will be interesting to see who comes in to make this decision.